But what is the point? If somebody says that uh, money will work for me, it means that that person is prepared to use his money in an ungodly way. If somebody says, I can use my money to make sure that you rot in jail, that person has money and is prepared to use that money in an ungodly way. If somebody does some evil and uses money to silence the witness bearers or truth bearers, then that means the person is ready to use that money in an ungodly way. And that is the challenge and the warning that we are getting tonight. We must ask ourselves, even whether we have money, small money or big money, we should always be very careful not to hold wealth. We should be careful that my money is not, our money is not used in an ungodly way. If the wealth we have is not praising God, then we have a problem. We should be very careful not to cheat people out of money. Most of us are not in the position of paying wages to workers. If we are, we should be generous and fair. There is a document, and I know you have it, it is called Commitment Document. The Commitment Document, as we, we, you, you'll hear it, it has uh, one of the articles, it has 12 articles, if you like, uh, and one of it is that businessmen and women are committing to pay the wages agreed. I don't know whether I have it here. Yes, it is here. Business Commitment 2022. Uh, then I want to do the, the wages. I want to see which, which number it is. Yeah, Article 9. Article 9 reads that I will at all times pay wages and salaries without delay and in accordance with the agreed terms. Part of the problem we have today is that uh, we've got men and women who want people to work for them, but they don't want to pay them their wages and their salaries as agreed. Now, that is evil. And that is why we said, if we want to do business with God and God's business, then we must make sure that if you have people working for you, please pay them their wages and salaries as agreed. Because it is part of how you use your money. You cannot call people or employ people. They work for you. You make money. And then you deny them their right. That is outright evil. <laughs>